Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I just did my hair. Postpartum hair loss is uh, quickly approaching. But yes, I am in my bathroom, which is this is probably the last time I'm going to be filming a beauty video in this bathroom because we're moving. We're moving. We're moving to a bigger house. I'm so happy. I'm so grateful. Listen, God is good. Everything that we wanted moved a little bit quicker. So we're able to move on base. And we are super duper excited. Um, so I am going to have my own space. I don't know if it's going to be a beauty room fully. I don't know how it's going to be in this new house. But I am so excited and I am so grateful to be doing this. Or to be able to move um baby girl's gonna have her own room right now she's still with us and she's going to be to at least six months but um her crib isn't up she doesn't have her own space she only has like a dresser her changing table so i'm just excited to be able to put that together and give her her own space and just have more space for us um so there's that but today we're going to be doing, you guys are going to hear my AC a little bit, sorry, it's just on, it'll turn off in a second. Um, firstly, secondly, this door has to stay open because the baby is sleeping in my room. So, with that being said, we're going to be doing a really quick mommy makeup. Um, I was watching my friend Charlotte's video and I was like, yo, I need to come up with a mommy makeup. So we're going to come up with a mommy makeup together because, listen... I'm tired of looking like poop. I'm tired of looking tired. I want to feel good. I did my hair. I just put some waves in it. It's hella dirty, um, but I don't want to wash it. This is the second time I put heat in it since I straightened it, and I really try to keep it as minimal as possible. So, firstly, I think that it's important to do my brows because I feel alive when I do my brows. So, we're gonna do our brows. So since this is mommy friendly, I think that a, if I still have any left, that a pencil is easiest. So we're just going to brush our brows out. I burned myself. I don't know if I said that already. Listen, my forehead is going to look hella big much bigger than normal because of my postpartum hair loss like the front of my hair you see how thin that is Ugh. ignore that I'm digging my brows right now and then I'm going to set them because we need to set them wait I should tell you guys what I'm using right so this all this stuff has been in my collection for a while all my videos for beauty is gonna be like that for a little while because I gotta use up what I have this is the brow conditioning primer brow bow conditioning primer and I'm using the NYX pencil boom let's do the luminizing primer by Dr. nope yeah, Dr. Brandt 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 and then Smashbox for my pores alright so I primed my face it feels nice and soft and moisturized and we're gonna get this face going. All right, so we need two things. We're gonna use the peach corrector because these under eye circles need a little bit of correcting. And we're gonna use our finger. Again, that's a burn. I'm not going to cover that because I think I'll make it worse. 
Then on top of that, we're gonna use our Fit Me Concealer. This is in the shade 20, Sand Sable. I'm trying to figure out if I want to put some foundation on. I used to love this Neutrogena foundation. They still have it. Literally, let's see if I can still use it. Match is nice. I literally used to wear this all the time, all through high school. You know how when people wore the, um, people wore, what did you guys wear in high school? The L'Oreal True Match. I wore Neutrogena, and this is my reasoning behind it. I was like, Neutrogena, skin clearing. I used to be very, um, naive when it came to makeup. And I would think that everything would cause me to break out. So, this is a dry sponge, by the way. I'm being lazy. I do not want to wet this. And I'm in the bathroom. I just have a lot of stuff here. So, turning on the water is not priority. And besides, who says I'm going to be able to wet this sponge when the baby is actually awake? too bright um yeah i remember this foundation it's still pretty good so we're gonna go back in with another with the 20 again just to give me a little bit more coverage i'm gonna let that sit for a second i'm gonna be right back i'm gonna check on the baby for the 50th time and she lets me finish this again with my finger i'm not really big on doing my makeup with my fingers when i was watching stralet's videos i was like you know what that makes sense melt the product with your finger on your face easy mom hack i hear her sucking on her fingers right now powder this is the rcma translucent powder i've had this for like ever and i recently probably within the last few months in february actually i got this little container for it. my sister and i we went, it was her 21st birthday we went to the casino and she bought like a strawberry shortcake i didn't want anything i was pregnant at the time too believe it or not i didn't want anything um I'm gonna use the massing, massing, matching foundation powder real quick just because I feel like I want to set my face. Baby girl woke up. So it's time to do this like a real mom. Like, like if I really had her awake, like no. So I'm using. Again, what I have, just warming up my face a little bit. This is the char, la la la, the dark chocolate soleil deep tan. Hey everybody, just stay quiet here for a minute. She's gonna be hungry though, very soon. It's been three hours. So very very soon. Okay, that's done. We're gonna go to a oldie but a goodie T Rose. Um, blush. Excuse me. Mom is filming here. Excuse my daughter. I'm gonna put her down, let her finish. I have this right here, the bathtub thing on here. 
All right, so we're gonna be using something that I got with my influencer. This is from the brand Jane Iridel. Iridel. The skincare makeup. They sent me two products. And I'm pretty excited. They came out really cute. Um, this is a eyeshadow palette, and then this is a eyeshadow primer. Ah, comes like this. The packaging looks like that. Inside, it looks like this. We're a mom, so we're in a rush. So we're just going to use this. Then using a regular fluffy brush, I'm actually gonna go in with this shade right here, the third shade. Does it have names? The third shade. See what it does. Nothing crazy. We're not. We're just adding some depth. Depth <laughs> to my eyes. Oh, what happened? Yeah. You want me to do your makeup? When you're one years old, mommy will do your makeup, okay? I really like this transition shade. And I am excited to do more looks with it in the near future. Alright, so, real quick. Uh, I don't know where it is. I don't know where my mascara, what is it called? Um, You're good about everything. Skin looks good. Think mommy looks good? Does mommy look good? Yeah? Yeah? Alright, I'm just gonna share my face real quick. As a mom, you don't have a lot of time, so you definitely want something that's going to last you a long time. So, I'm going to use the Real Her makeup line real quick. This is my favorite lip products. I literally used to use these on all my clients, especially for weddings, because they last a long time. You definitely want something long-lasting when you're a mom. So, I'm going to be using Woman Rule the World. This is the look I'm like, well, hold on. And then I'm gonna use I Am Perfect lip liner. I mean, lip. What? So this is a perfect, like, everyday nude. You like it? You like this color? I'm not gonna pick you up. You need to change your diaper. This is the actual lip liner I was looking for. I had to sharpen it. I need to get a real sharpener because... <sighs> this one is I Am Precious. And it just gives me a little bit more off. And trust me, this lip color will last you all day long. Ask any of the brides that I have had. It's literally my favorite um, 
liquid lipstick right now or has been for a while I'll be right back I need to change her diaper this is my mommy makeup look I definitely feel really good right now I feel put together it's been a hot minute since I've felt put together like I don't feel like overly done but I don't feel like a bum okay I don't plan on going anywhere today I just wanted to feel good for myself so make sure that you do so make sure that you do things that make you feel good don't take yourself away from the things that make you feel good even if it's like putting some makeup on it's not vain it's nothing it's just to make your yourself feel good about yourself and then you can feed your soul and you can just feel like your old self because being a mom a first-time mom honestly takes you away from everything you have ever known for yourself so yeah this is my mommy makeup look i'm really happy i feel really good about myself right now i really really do so this is my mommy makeup look i just finished eating some cheez it's and drinking some lemonade and my lips are still good so, if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys on my next video. Bye guys.